Good morning comrades, welcome back to the channel, welcome back to the Nürburgring and welcome to a lap in probably the least suited vehicle for the Nürburgring unless you're deciding to go straight through Adenauer Forest. Least suited vehicle ever, like ever. Nissan Patrol V6 with off-road tires. I would almost say we have to go straight through Adenauer Forest because it says Forest Betrieb, so Forest Service. Oh, and also police. Oh, sorry, it's a Nissan Tirano. Uh, I'm pretty sure by now already 200 people in the comments said that it's a Toronto and not a patrol. But uh, let's hop in and uh, try to make it. Yes. Max speed, 160. That's good to know. <laughs> Hope it will be not too dark because I forgot to take my ND filter off uh, because it was still light, but we'll see. Should I pick this one here? Oh, uh, yeah, you can do count. it. Yeah, you can do it. Actually, let's... Here are per. I am out of credit. So I have my JK. Okay. Don't rev it over four. It's like over four. I don't okay. know something with the bell. You hear that? Yeah. Oh, and let's say uh, sit and for a hunt for a couple of days, and you can book it with them or a private. That's how you become a hunter. It's very straightforward, actually. Yeah, well, because this is something I really want to do, because I used to hunt with my dad a lot when I was a kid. Mm -hmm. uh, and this is something I would like to do here, and I never knew how to do it. Oh, I can uh, give you a little poll update later. That Very would be nice. Cheers! <laughs> 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 It's probably the most exclusive vehicle on the track. One for of a kind. Yeah. <laughs> okay, we should go actually on the right through the grass <laughs> yes. here. And you know, nothing on this car is electronic. No ABS, no ESP, nothing. <laughs> it's all the driver. So. Hmm. Not worry with you, but generally, you know. <laughs> <laughs> we'll get there one day. We'll, we'll get there. Will we hit a hundred before <laughs> compression? We will. <laughs> okay. And the tires are very, very, you know. Yeah, yeah, off-roady. Yeah. like that too much. The whole downshifting before the corner thing <laughs> doesn't like it too much. It's actually quite comfortable and good. I'm setting to sport. So. Ooh. <laughs> Such a luxury. It's from 94 for that time. It has That's all nice. the bells and whistles actually. What did it fall off? <laughs> Was that I'm the key? Not going to stop it. uh, it's the key. How did the key fall out and we're still driving? Doug <laughs> DeVore uh, would say the car has quirks and features. Yeah. That's actually something I would call probably very Russian if you want to hunt somewhere in the winter and you want to go somewhere for 10 minutes but don't want to turn the car off. <laughs> you know, that's how you do it. Yeah. Take, take the key. Okay. You're really sending it, eh? Well, um... <laughs> you always see those cars with like... What's it called? The uh, Nissan RB26 engine somewhere in Dubai. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, uh, I guess they can handle some track use. Yeah. It's really good actually. Yeah, I know. I like it. And it breaks well for, for everything that it has. Yeah. But the thing is with those SUVs, they need to break good because so you, sometimes you... It's not an SUV. Don't, don't insult the car. Okay, what is this? It's a proper off-roader. 4 4 yeah. 4 4 yeah. It's a proper, proper off-road car. That's why it's only got rear... Um, rear... Um, Rear-wheel drive right now, right? Because, ah. Uh, when it's in four-wheel drive, it's, everything is locked, so you cannot really drive on asphalt because there is no differential. I am properly impressed 
how you drive this car. I mean, I'm holding back a bit because... It's good and I appreciate it. <laughs> Ah, we smell the brakes already a bit. Yeah, I had it before as well. Ah, okay. They, they tend to go soft when going to bright side, even driving slower. Ah. That's my impression. <laughs> but yeah, the braking is fine, right? Yeah. Surprisingly, actually. It's very nice. I'm happy. I'm happy to, to share a car experience with you that you would normally not. Yeah, I hope that uh, the camera footage is not too dark, otherwise we'll have to do another lap some point. <laughs> No, uh, only the uh, RCN next uh, oh. week. So. Yeah, I have a Dutch shirt. Ah, cool. And I have my name on one of this first car. I wonder oh, that's cool. Yeah, I have like the very first. Uh, yeah, I have the Dutch shirt. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, 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 I was very surprised to find my name on there and I didn't know which YouTube account I used to subscribe and I was like, oh, that's my real name, I don't like it. <laughs> okay, no problem. Uh, there's an M2. Uh, but we'll catch up with him in the next corner. Okay. Right. <laughs> oh, it's getting proper dark, almost like N24 vibes. <laughs> This would be the, the fastest car in the ring in the, what was it, 2017, when there was a hailstorm? Oh yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Could have overtaken a GT3. Yep. <laughs> and, uh, you the, the now, right? and you can smell the brakes as well. Yeah. This is the most mellow part of the track in this car. Yep. It's just like cruising on the right side, it doesn't matter. I saw the video of you, of you taking this guy up, the, the, this YouTuber from the UK, uh, up Schleitschlecke. Oh, yeah. That was quite funny because you know when my mom did the lap on the GT2 RS? Yeah. Um, we went up Schleitschlecke before. We went to Carousel okay. from Hoaf and took a walk in the afternoon before. So, cool. So we were at the very same place. Nice. It's so beautiful here. It's, it's very beautiful. It's, I think, perfect for you guys living here in this uh, beautiful village. Yeah. Having the most insane track in front of your house, making a living out of it, and going to mountain bike or whatever. Yeah. I don't know how it is with hunting in Rhineland Pfalz, by the way, because it's a state thing in Germany. Yeah. But the acquisition of the hunting license is universal in Germany. So okay. There's no difference. There's only local laws for things like. Uh, if you can use a suppressor or not, they're state-based. Okay. I get it. So, so you're cooling it down a bit? No, I'm just like... But it doesn't have the horsepower to go. Yeah. Down. It's supposed to have 148 horsepower, actually. Okay. But, well... It's actually very controllable. Yeah. And we have the sports set, right? as I said. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know how it is and if you have the tracks not open in winter when it's snow, right? It's no. Absolutely closed. So. Because it would be funny to try if it's funny for 
It would be. It's a perfect beginner's car. <laughs> that you see what this can do you're thinking of building this to a track car why well, it's my third car so <laughs> it's exclusively for hunting normally <laughs> it get, look at this look at the automator it has 75 70. oh really and since 94 is yes. it really only yes wow impressive so it's a new car almost wow oh that was great <laughs> thanks again again i hope it's not too dark but otherwise <laughs> We'll just do it again. <laughs> nice. Let's go down the brakes. <laughs> oh yeah, that was a blast. Thank you. Yeah. Cool. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope again it was not too dark. Unfortunately, I still had my ND filter on, so um, maybe it was. And then we'll just do another lap. Then maybe it's just a members-only video. We'll see. So, thanks for watching. Bye. And thanks for for this amazing opportunity. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of hope that the footage was not okay so we can do another lap. <laughs> it's way too dark now, but I hope you can see that we have the key, the car is running. And it's just like my car. And now it's off, perfect.